All right, check it out. The total eclipse of the heart. Shout out 80s, that song. But uh, yeah, the eclipse is coming up a couple days away. And uh, a bunch of places are doing special uh, eclipse items. And uh, Krispy Kreme is no different. Is it three days, four days? Limited time, you can get this, what is it? Total eclipse donut with Oreo cookie. Check it out right there. I'm gonna explain it all. I'm gonna take a bite. We're gonna we're gonna see what it brings. But I do like it. It is uh, very reminiscent of the eclipse and what it's going to look like. But you don't need any glasses for this one. We're gonna check it out. Cue the intro. What is up, everyone? It is the endorsement, and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive. Got a little bit of a crookedness. Let's take it up a notch a little bit. All right, what is this? Food Review 101? All right, so this is the Total Solar Eclipse Donut. It is a limited time treat featuring I wasn't going to throw the box because it has a bunch of crumbs in it. Uh, featuring the original glazed donut uh, dipped in rich black chocolate icing. Then you're going to have it's uh, garnished with silver sprinkles right there. And um, filled with buttercream infused with Oreo cookie pieces right there under the Oreo. And you're also going to have it crowned with an Oreo cookie in the center. Limited time. All right, so what is, I was just talking with um, Burger Beast about this eclipse and what, isn't it the best area to see the full, the full total totality of the um, solar eclipse is in like the center of the country is like, I keep doing this, but I think I saw a map that shows uh, where the best spots are and people are actually traveling uh, to get the best total um, experience to be immersed into the uh, full total eclipse. So there it is one more time. Every time they throw a cookie on there, it's like hard to eat because if you try to bite through and get a big bite and go through the cookie, the cookie like flips up on the other end. You know what I'm talking about. It's a whole big thing. So you kind of got to like nibble or maybe take the cookie off. Maybe I'll take the cookie off. We all know what an Oreo is and then kind of go in. But I just kind of wanted to document this because it is a pretty big day. What was the last total eclipse? Like total eclipse. Was it like... Eight years ago nine years ago i saw some video from 1979 that shouted out 2024 they're like you gotta wait to 2024 before you can see another uh total let's see what this buttercream's all about that's good all right so there it is without um the center right there all right let's take a bite i mean it is what it is this is more like you know, fanfare. This is more like a novelty item uh, because of the total eclipse, but it's just a glazed donut with um, some chocolate uh, frosting right there and some buttercream topping. And then I like it that they teamed up with Oreo on this. It is what it is. Let's take a bite. Ooh. That's a fresh one. Okay. I will say this, it's sort of basic, but at the same time with those like sugar crystals, give it a little extra texture and the buttercream, which I am a sucker for buttercream. And then a original glazed donut, thing's kind of money. The thing is kind of money and it's a fresh one. So that works too. Um, another bite. Mm. Mm. That's a good donut. All right, so April uh, 5th, that's today, when this um, donut launched, it's going to go to Monday the 8th, which I think is the eclipse day. Uh, Monday the 8th is the uh, solar eclipse. Um, and I also will mention one other thing in this video, as you see it in the bottom of the uh, camera. 
I attempted to get through, I just, I, I'll just be honest, I because I mentioned I was going to go uh, the whole month of April with no Duncan. I went to Duncan because mainly I was coming here to review this donuts, iced coffee, iced latte, I should say. And we all know it, Java Sock not sponsored. So listen, let's give it a rating um, on a scale of 1 to 100, with 1 meaning don't even waste your money, and 100 being the promised land of... I'm going to give the Total Solar Eclipse Donut from Krispy Kreme a three-day event, um, a rating of... That was a good donut. I'm going to give it a 90. I'm going to give it an even number, a straight up 90. That's 9 out of 10 for all you keeping score at home. Logging it into your endorsement notebooks. Thank you so much for checking out this video. And um, there you go. Another review in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media getting the word on my channel out to the masses. In closing, there you go. Light up the comments. Inform me a little bit more about the total eclipse happening on Monday. I know certain parts of the country, like I said, what are those certain parts of the country? And are you in those certain parts of the country? Do you have those special glasses? And are you excited to check out this phenomenon? And um, I'm interested to hear. So thank you so much. I appreciate each and every one of you. I hope you enjoyed this video. Got out here early, filming it, gonna edit it, make the thumbnail, and launch it later today. And you'll be seeing this on Friday the 5th. So thank you so much. Again, Total Eclipse of the Heart. Total Eclipse of the Heart. Name the band that sang that song without Googling it in the uh, 80s. I'm pretty sure it came out in the 80s. Again, we'll see you soon with some more reviews.